Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about it. it. What's up, y'all? KP and Ronnie back with episode four. Um, we're going to call this episode 100 Shots. We have a special guest, and we call it 100 Shots because I just feel like it's symbolic to who he is. He's been through a lot of shit, like not just physical shots, like taking losses as far as deaths or people around him and stuff. So I just feel like through all that, taking 100 Shots, like he, nigga's still here. So Ronnie going to introduce. Yes, we do have a special guest here today. Um, this is his first time on the podcast, so we're getting exclusive. Um, it is Dean, a.k.a. Dean the Do You. That's right. <laughs> um, so, I guess we're just going to get straight to it. Um, so, we know you've been doing music, and, you know, you got videos, different songs. How long have you been doing music? I'm going to say I'm gonna say a year now, but, uh, like, nine months, like, nine months. I say a year because I started with Little Rodad. Mm -hmm. And it be a year, April 2nd since he been gone. So I'm going to say a year, but it's nine months, though. And was that your motivation? Like, what motivated you? Yeah, yeah. That was my motivation. Um, I took, I said I got to channel my energy into something positive, you know, versus revert back to what I know. Because if I was putting the same energy in the streets, It'd be crazy. You see, I, you know what I mean? I'm going crazy with the music, so I say this is my drive right here. He's smiling down on me. You feel me? Agree, agree. So that's how you're dealing with your grief? Yeah, yeah. Studio work or stay busy. If I get in my thoughts, you know, like, you know what I mean? No idle time, the devil playground. So you just sitting there, you're like, man, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. Or somebody can call you, like, like right now, I'm doing something. They can't call me. Like my phone don't sound. I'm doing something. You can't reach me. You can't. These hours right here, I don't know what to do. I can't help you. Yeah. Okay. So, you've been doing the music for you said nine months a year. Um, I see that you've been had shows like in New York, and you've been moving. You've been working. So like, how did it like pop so fast for you? Cause like it's niggas that been doing this for a while that haven't like done some of the things that you've done in this brief. A That's the million dollar question, man. It's like, I say Allah. I say Allah because, like you say, I'm like, dang, I was scared at first, too, though. I was working at Target Warehouse before that happened. So that happened. I go to Vegas, and I just came up with a blueprint out there. I was like, either I'm going to come back home and go crazy, or I'm going to go hard. But, you know, it takes money to make money, so... You know what I mean? I'm just putting it out there like this is what I want to do, but I got a real story at the end of the day too. So they want to hear it and I guess they loving it. You know what I mean? They, they, they calling for me. Okay. So um, I listened to your song, The Real Story. Okay. That's off that Mozzie beat. That's one of my favorites right, that you thank, got. Thank you. Um, and I know you talked about, you know, your homeboy mm -hmm. getting life. Like how did that affect you and the music as well? That that jump really affected me uh, right now to this day a lot, but that's also my drive. But that was my drive even before the music, cause I was like, I can't let them down. You know what I'm saying? Like they rooting for me. They was already rooting for me to stay home, do good. You know, of course, be there for them. Like, cause you know, you got somebody genuine, genuine friend. So, if it, Lord forbid, something ever happened to one of y'all, you know, you can come. You know what I'm saying? So. That's another thing, like, I ain't coming out here, you know, nigga, I was a junk at one time, EP, it was getting high. So when you don't come back out here and revert to what you usually do, you know, they like, you know what I mean? That's, that's the applause, so I feel good. I mean, that's definitely what my drive. Okay, so you said that you think um, you pop because of Allah, so mm -hmm. your religion is Muslim? Muslim, yeah. How long have you been... I've been Muslim, man, for a long time, right? But I, uh, I want to say, like, right before all that stuff happened with Ro, I was reading, like, I really got into it, like, heavier. And, you know, a lot of people only do it incarcerated. They don't do it on land. So I really took my time. You know, I was doing the personal training. When I did that, I took all that in. Like, I went to TCC, uh, picked up on my prayer more, read, pray. Cause I was asking him, just guide me, you know, cause you know the devil took you wherever he wanted to you. So I'm like, man, I'm about to get down five times a day. Pray to this man, look, man, just guide me. You know, we got Rocky before he guided me, but 
He got me though. You know what I mean? Okay. Okay. <laughs> so with that praying five times, I see like he has had grace with you. I'm gonna just be blunt. I've seen that you been shot a couple times. How many times have you been? Shot? I actually been shot nine times altogether. Fifty. A <laughs> <laughs> hundred shot. <laughs> I've been shot. I've been shot nine times, man. Um, and what, what come with that is life. You know. You know. I'm a big person that what goes around comes around. You know. So, like I told my mama, I ain't no saint. You know what I mean? But. I never harm my friends or like no cruddy, you know what I mean? Like I ain't never do you nothing ain't never to nobody. Grimy. Yeah, grimy, yeah. yeah. Like steal, you know, do steal from their mama, their mm-hmm. sister. I ain't never did that. If I love you and you around me, I ain't doing nothing to you. Mm-hmm. Now if I don't know you, it might be another story, but I ain't with that no more though. No yeah. shit. I'm, I'm living good. We living life. That's good. Okay. Okay, so what is like what is being real to you? Like, what is real, being real to you? Real is loyalty. Real is loyalty. So, like, what you do behind my back, for, for, for the most part, you know, what you do without wanting uh, clout for it, you know what I mean, wanting clarity for it, uh, taking care of your kids, you know what I mean, for sure, being there for your family. That's, that's like the main part, man, loyalty, man, because that go with everything with it. If you loyal, you're going to be loyal to everything around you. So that go with real, you know what I mean? Okay. Okay, I agree. Um, What's your relationship status? Right now, man, right now. <laughs> <laughs> Shit getting a little sick. <laughs> you don't want to say the wrong right thing. Now, I'm setting nah. the wrong person. Nah, nah, right now. Um, Let's focus on the music, man. <sighs> it's crazy, man. Right now, for real, I, I'm going to say, like, you know, you can't get time back. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I done bad things. I wish people time, you know what I mean? But it's just like, with relationships right now, I don't think nobody really ready for no relationship right now. If you ain't all the way in chat, because it may be some things that your man don't want you to do. You might not be ready to let go. Or it might be some things, you know, vice versa. You know what I mean? Who want the perfect love story anyway? Like so, that. you single? Because <laughs> you still ain't asking <laughs> the question. And they said it. Uh, nah, I ain't single. I ain't single. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. So, um, even though you aren't single, like, what's your ideal woman? Like, what is your type? Uh, like, and not just, like, physically. Like, I mean, you could tell us both, but I'm I not like, just speaking in a physical term. You know, I'm term. a big fan of marriage. I really like Older women for real. Oh, okay. Nah, I mean, but I just because of fact, like they they got sense. Like you ain't gotta keep telling them what to do, or they season. They know what they want. You know what I'm saying? Like, no disrespect to the young girl. Like you gotta keep, or they be. I'm ready to go out. I'm ready to turn it in. They just crazy. It's too much. I'm through. I might be 33. I ain't got the energy to keep dealing with running up and down the street. You <laughs> holler them out. Got them. Know what I'm saying? I want somebody in the house, laundry on. Cook, you know okay. what I'm saying? I come in the house, I rub her feet, kiss her, tell her about my day, you know what I'm saying? We okay. go from there, you know what I'm okay. saying? So, cute, is cute. older, are you considering older. that your age or older? It like gotta 40. be like. I mean, I, it depends on how she look. <laughs> I, I mean, is, she cool? is she like 45, 44, and she bad? Or like, you know. Like Miss Parker on, the, on Friday. Exactly, like exactly. I mean. fix Miss Parker. <laughs> 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 oh God! Okay, Where okay, is it? okay. So prior to your, I don't know what to call it, your relationship, situation, shit, whatever you have uh-huh. going on now, like prior to that, have you ever like been in love? Are yeah, you? man. I um, oh, I've been in love like two times. I mean, I've been in love like twice. But when I was younger, I had a situation with a uh, female, and I might have a child that's like 14, you know what I'm saying? But the situation was like, I got heartbroken, you know what I mean? So I've never really learned how to love no more after that. You know what I mean? You know, I'm real up on the street. So when we put our oil in something, you know, I love hard anyway, I'm Aries, so 
Shorty, shorty, real life did some crazy stuff like with my man. You know what I'm saying? So, mm. and I and I and I, you know what I mean? I ain't, you know, it's my life, so I gotta talk about it. Uh, but that joint, my mama really had to. Come. I was young, like 14, 15. You know what I mean, my mama had to come pull me out of the room. Like, boy, you better get out of this room. You know what I mean? Like, go well, how be old the was man she? I raised you. Like two years old than me. So, so like 16. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Oh yeah. yeah. I was in the streets, young, young, young. Nah, yeah, yeah. No. So I was really in love. I was in love though. And one more after that. But I love hard though. So everybody I've been with, I love. You loved, yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I was really in love. Them two possessive. Yeah. But like, we are, yeah. were you in Arizona love possessive. all them times? You can love somebody and but not be in love. In love. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. But he still loved them very hard. Yeah, yeah, I love them. Okay. okay. So I heard you speak about possibly have having a kid with her. Um, I do see that you have kids. I've mm-hmm. seen you pray with your kids. Um, mm-hmm. You have sons and daughters. Um, how many kids do you have? Four. Okay, so you have sons and daughters. What do you like, what is your goal? Like, what are you hoping to instill in your kids? Uh, right now, like the main thing that is respect. Like, uh, respect, love one another, be there for one another. Uh, just all kind of things. Like, I told my son, you know, don't look down on people, like, especially that, you know what I mean? Like, they might not be as fortunate as your mom or your daddy, you know what I mean? So don't go in there like, ah, you got them on in school, whatever. Be, you know what I'm saying? They, they actually, from from them deeds, one of my sons gave away some stuff to it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so that's nice. I just want them to be respectable, you know what I mean? Like, things that, and I wouldn't say do the people that I wouldn't want that, because I can handle it, but they might not be able to yeah. handle it. You know what I mean? It's a criminal. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, so um, it's the last question before we get into this little game. We're going to play with you. Um, I see, I, I, I'm, this is based off of observation, so if I'm wrong, correct me, but it seems like you were raised by like a single mom. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And I know that it's a conversation, we even talked about it on our last episode, where it's like, do you feel like women are more masculine? These days, or being right. that your mom, your, your mom raised you, have you always seen like a more dominant masculine type of woman? Yeah, women definitely rule the world, man. Y'all rule the world for real, for real. Yeah, I do. I can't take that from y'all, man. Like, y'all don't get no breaks. You know what I mean? Y'all got it's, on, it's very rare that daddy got it. You know what I mean? Y'all got to break y'all sleep, get up from school, and well, Lord forbid, y'all got a lot of them. <laughs> you know what I mean? Get up from school. You know what I'm saying? You got to get up from school. Ooh, child. I just got one. It's still a lot. You like, see what I'm saying? Be one with a lot. time in sports. Sometimes it's two sports at one time. Facts, facts. Like, I don't get no me time. And when I do get me time, I feel guilty for not doing shit with him. So then I'm doing shit with him. Y'all definitely masculine, though. You said y'all like. Women or like us? Women, <laughs> no, women, women for it, women for it, for real. Cause y'all strong when y'all don't even, don't even know how to be strong. You know what I'm saying? Like, see, men strong, like, we were raised, don't hit her, don't. Mm-hmm. Y'all was raised some uh, sport, you know, like, we we'll open the door for, uh, you know, girls get, you know what I mean? That we don't, we get like smacked up our head, boy. You feel me? Yeah. Oh, open that door. You better foot. not yell at that girl. Wait, cause realistically, <laughs> how many times have you beat your son? Mm-hmm. Lost count, long time ago. How many times have you beat your daughter? Ugh, maybe twice. See what I'm saying? <laughs> they get away with murder. Yeah. She do. She definitely yeah. gets away she with be murder. With you like she times. play, but I had to get her just recently because sis had me mm. all the way messed up. Yeah, Ooh, I, I had to go in my room and calm myself down. That's so mad. Oh yeah. Because yeah, I yeah. thought like, we was in the streets. How about you beat me out? <laughs> Sad, sis. Yes, <laughs> but she not even that type of child though. No, but was working her nerves. Yeah. She just was. I don't know. She get her little ways, but she's a good child overall. That's what's man, up. my son. Ooh, child, get you a run for your money. Ooh. That's what's up. That's what's up. Yeah. So I mean, that is true. Okay. So we're gonna play this or that. Mm. We're gonna give you a scenario. You gotta choose one. So it's gonna be this or either that. Um, and I may ask you to explain why you chose what you chose. Right. So you can start it off to the side. Because I wanted to. <laughs> it's like a tag team. All right. Got you, got you. Okay. So should I do like well, I think we should the, do racy like the, no, we the racy ones first? Last. Yes. Okay. Um, power or money? And why? Definitely want to know why. So do I see? You, well, you could choose this to or have that. Power, or power you this to have money. or money. Right, okay, okay. Uh, 
I'm gonna say money. So what's what's money? That or this? It don't. I don't. We don't. You know. say you say power or money. Money, money, money. And why? Okay, why? Because with money you can gain power. Okay. You can gain power with money. And the, the whole world want money. Okay. Anybody want money? So, if you would you like to meet your younger self or meet your older self? My younger self. Why? What would you tell your younger self? Like. I, I tell him go a different route from what he did. Like, don't pick that route, you feel me? Don't listen to them, don't pick up no drugs, don't pick up no gun. It's something else over the other side of the world. I would have done all them bullets, you know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. Would you want to be invisible or be able to fly? Damn, that's a, that's a <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Damn. <laughs> that's, that's butter. Mm. That's hard, ain't it? Because <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to be both. I, I really don't Damn. know. Damn. But no, you know what? I say fly. And I was going to say that. Yeah, Go I ahead. say fly Why? because once you fly, you're going to be invisible anyway because can't nobody can't else fly. Yeah, you can't see you. Right. Yeah. Yeah. But the birds. The birds, yeah. yeah. That's it. And I'm going to get there like that. Mm -hmm. I don't need no... Uh, Spirit or none of that. Bitch you there. <laughs> Monica, I'm a, I'm, I'm, who you flying with? Oh, I'm gonna meet you in Miami. That nigga be real, man. That nigga be real. Real question, real quick. Yeah, go ahead, please, because you've been real quiet. You real quiet like, today. No, no, I'm over here checking shit though, but. You can't fly to no bank, but if you're invisible, you can walk, walk in there. Walk in the bank. But, can, but being invisible, does that, does that mean you can turn the money invisible? Because if they just see a blob of money going out the bank, like nobody <laughs> just sitting there watching that shit. You're stuck for shit. a second while you move. Yeah, yeah I'm going to be stuck for a second, but come up like you might not. Somebody might think to run into whatever and tackle oh, your invisible I can be ass. invisible, snatch your keys, get in the vault. Come, yeah, you know I mean, it's, it's, but what I'm saying is, jungle. but what yeah. can you make? Do you have an invisibility cloak where you can put over your shit so it can be invisible too? I need that if I'm gonna be invisible, like but a cloak. No, everything need to be invisible. But that way, but everything under my cloak is yeah. invisible. Get what I need to get is yeah. fly, fly away. Bats, that what I want to say. <laughs> <laughs> fly away though. You will never catch me. But they are gonna have your face. Yeah, that's <laughs> true. I still, but that actually, if I'm not, they ain't gonna see me. They ain't gonna never catch. That is true. Every time they come, fly away. That was okay. That was a good joke. Yeah, that was a good one. Okay. Um, sound or sight. So would you choose to be blind or be able to hear? Be deaf. I sound be, or sight. I'd rather be blind. So I wanna have to see all this bullshit in the world. <laughs> that's that's a good answer too. Uh, but I really I'd rather really, really be blind, man. This some bullshit. But you won't have man. to hear about that shit. I, now, I ain't even worrying about it. I don't even look. Uh, watch my sight go on the camera. Yeah, right, look. <laughs> I sight though, I don't even come around. I don't even see who you is. What would you rather do? Have sound or sight? Oh, I would rather have sound. You know, I'm gonna learn some sound language. Fact. Gonna be all I right. want to be deaf, man. You know what I'm saying? I would rather. You know how sound. crazy that is? Like I, I was just seeing some sound. And then you know, I worked in ENT for seven years, so we had deaf patients and people with hearing aids and shit and cochlear implants. You know what I'm saying? Like I might get my sound back. So I'm not gonna be blind. I need to see what the fuck going on. Bitches be playing. I need to see, bitch. I don't gotta hear you. Come Wait. So what do you want to be? I want to be able to see. See now. You hear. said sound. At yeah, first. I would rather lose sound. Is what I meant. Okay. Yeah, I know what the fuck I mean. I, I didn't. Lose. You just confused Girl, me. Please. Anyway, I would rather lose my sound. I can do some sign language. See, I would rather have sound because, like, I love music. Music. I can't like, do nothing yeah. for myself, though. Like, I can't drive myself. I need help. You know what I'm saying? I cannot be codependent on nobody. Like, I feel like being blind is going to make me more handicapped. I'm not Stevie Wonder, bitch. Being blind is going to make me more handicapped than being deaf. That's just how I feel. And that's from a personal experience of working with deaf people for seven years. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I'm good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I want to see what the fuck going on. Mm -hmm. I need to see. Be right. fucking these ugly niggas like I still, <laughs> I ain't half still fuck ugly niggas. But at least I knew he was ugly nigga. Like you didn't fool me. I yeah. knew what I was getting into. You got yeah. to feel his face. Mm -mm. Yeah, else, you can feel the feature. What he look like, girl? Girl, he look good, girl. <laughs> ugly. <laughs> no, get somebody else to do it. So yeah. Um, oh shit. Okay. That was your question. Okay. So yeah. Man. Old school movies or music? Now I know what you're gonna say. Yeah. <laughs> music. Music. Yeah, music. Definitely. But I, I love, love old school. But you would have to choose one for the rest of your life. 
Music, facts. Okay. Music. I love music. I always love music. Even before I started rapping, like, Lil Ro used to tell me rap, bro, because I always could articulate my words. That's what I meant to and tell you. This is y'all. so off topic, but you mentioned Lil Ro a couple times, and I, can you tell us who that is to you and like okay, what happened okay, with okay, him? Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry, yeah, y'all. Lil Ro, Lil Ro, man, that's my childhood friend, man. Um, I think we met each other like, we were like 11, 10. And my bro just asked me, like, where you from? I'm like, I'm from Young Pop, but you know, a lot of people think I'm from Curry Pop, because mm-hmm. I really was out there. Yeah. But yeah, we met, like, we met through Kali, rest in peace, Kali. Mm-hmm. Um, both of us were sweet, you know what I'm saying? So Kali seen me, he was like, man, I want you to meet somebody. We go out Curry Pop, he, 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 we, we on the beach cruise, and he got around the bars. Right, you know what I mean? Come on, we go out to Curry Pop on the basketball court, roll out there, I never forget. Got the same shoes on, we like, yeah, you know what I mean? Boom, boom, boom. This, and we locked right there and there, you know what I mean? We had everything on us, hardball, money, all the same thing. Like, that was how he was like, nigga, you ain't got this, you ain't got my young nigga. Mm-hmm. So I'm pulling my money out, we like, nigga, I got my money too. <laughs> Like, you ain't got no work like that one too. So I like, I bet you I know what you ain't got. He was like, what? I pulled out a deuce deuce or 22. He said, no, I ain't got one. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't got that. I ain't got no gun. He said, I ain't got one. You got it. But we clicked for right there. So, man, we were 90 days, man. But um, unfortunately, you know what I'm saying? Um, it kept my brother in the mall, man. Man, out the mall, you know what I'm saying? And that jump, even like, it's so crazy because you know last year all these days right here was just yeah, yeah. just dark days for me you know what i'm saying mm-hmm. so and even right now you know what i'm saying i'm still recuperating from it but uh that was my brother man my close friend my best friend somebody i wish i could call right now you feel mm-hmm. me like yeah so uh, very close with their family yeah fact she yeah. always there she always there so. man and I, and I thank her for that man uh but yeah, man, thank you for sharing that light to them too, you know what I'm saying? That's that's my dog, man, you know what I mean? That's who I'm doing it for, do it for real, you know what I mean? I'm doing it for real, man, like, and it's paying off. Like, that's a new thing, I think, like, that's a, yeah, he, he got a lot to do with it too. Yeah, yeah, he got I'm a lot to do with it. I'm telling you he do, because I feel like that about my grandma, like, for real. everything that happens good in my life, I know she, like, yeah, got yeah. some say in that, for like. Sure, for sure, yeah. One more thing, <clears throat> before Ru died, I lost my first cousin. My, my, that's like my closest cousin, my first cousin. He died two weeks before Ro. You know what I'm saying? So I lost him, you know, that was on back to back. Like, yeah, my grandma lost her brothers like, six days apart. For real? Six days apart, then her other brother died like two months later, and my uncle died, like her oldest son. Everything. Like back to back, back, four back to back. Our yeah, family yeah. just was like, so I, I, I can't sympathize right? with yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Shit yeah. was wrong. I mean, that happened with my grandma too. Yeah. My grandma my died, and then my uncle died. And your folks died tragically. Yeah, like, both of them. Both of them deaths, deaths was tragic. tragic. For real. Back, like back to back. Then when it yeah. rains, it pours. Absolutely. Yeah, it do. It do, all right, so going back to this or that, with that conversation we just had, um, I have, would you change your past mm. or know your future? Change my past or know my future. Stay in my past and know my future. I change my past. Okay. No, I'm lying. <laughs> I'm lying. Never mad. And that question when I was like, I met the younger me. Uh, yeah, no, because for real, like, a lot of this stuff really made me who I am. Ooh, like, wow. yeah. I got book smart and street smart. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm really smart for real, for real. Like, a lot of dudes ain't smart. They can't think. That's why they stagnant and complacent. That's why a lot of things working better for me because I know you got to know how to move. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got to know what's going on. You got to know your, you got to read the room. You know what I'm saying? You got to know what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? And it ain't going to just be in one spot. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Jay Z left New York. You know what I'm saying? You, yeah, you, shit left here. you got the move. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Monica, what would you do? I'm just curious. Um, I think I would know my future because, like you said, like, I, I feel like the stuff that I went through was like, something that had to be done yeah, like go i needed to i mean <laughs> and i agree but like if i didn't i wouldn't know what i know now i don't know 
I can't. I, I can't answer that. It, it made me a question, better. It make you a better player in the game. Yeah. If you, if you get that, like it make you a better. I player. feel like I can't even. I wouldn't because even be able to teach my kids certain things like if, if I, I didn't go through. It. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But I also feel like if I know my future, like, am I gonna fuck it up now that I know? You know what I'm saying? That's a, that's a good. That's a good. Yeah. Thing. I mean, I, I, th- future, I thought about that am too. Am I gonna fuck it up now that I know it? Like. Am I gonna be consciously thinking about what I, what I got to do to get to, to that it? Future yeah. instead of letting life happen yeah. organically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But what if you knew your future and it said you're gonna be dead and got down? That's two years. that. That was what I was thinking too. See, that's gonna fuck me up too. You got forty-eight months. Oh, I'm finna <laughs> turn that. Oh no, listen. <laughs> I'm living my best life, baby. Oh, yeah, that's shit. true too. So, what would you do? What about y'all? If a nigga, they would tell me I was going to be No, 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 nigga, no. If, would you change your past or would you know your future? Like, I probably got down. I, yeah, I wouldn't change. I wouldn't change my past. I probably would. If I had the luxury of doing it, I probably would because there's so many people that died. Yeah, I'm that's gonna how I feel. I would go and got probably make them alive. But then I'm, I look at it like, shit, then what that's going to lead me at right now? Because yeah. I feel like. You know all that shit, like you said, all that shit that you've been through does make like, you a better. It, it, it builds character and yeah. make you. But like, shit, I probably if I had options, like I bring my mama back, my uncle back, all these people back. You know what I mean? My homeboy. Right, but I just wonder, like, back. if What's I, the show? Yeah, I what, if I, like, how my life would be if I, like, would I have known you if somebody would have came back or would we? Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that, you don't know what's going to, what it's going to. And, and or and would I have ever moved to Richmond? Like, see, if, my if I would have, if, if, if I could change my past, I don't know. I could bring my daddy back. If I bring my daddy back, I would Kentucky. not live in with no, we was about to move to New Jersey. I wouldn't live in Virginia. I would not but know you. You would have met Aisha and then you would have been her friend and then I would have came to New Jersey and then <laughs> she's like, it's my friend Ronica. And I was like, oh, hey, Ronica. And we would have loved each other still. I mean, it could have happened that way. It could have. So it, that's a that's a very hard question. No yeah, question, though. It's it a hard is. question. It's a very yeah, a hard question. question. Which one of y'all thought of that? Her. Okay, okay. She thought of all this. Yeah, that was a good yeah. These are my That was a good That's yeah. Oprah. Yeah. Okay, um, this is the last one that's not racy. I only got one racy on there. This oh, I got three. But. So you don't, have, you don't have to think of some shit on the go, bro. Career or marriage and love? A career or marriage and love. But you can only have one. So whichever one you choose, that's what you have to have for the rest of your life. A career. Facts. And I love my kids so much. Like, I'm so full of love. I can make everything else with a career. Like, um, I need to, yeah. You feel me? Okay. Oh, I got two kids. You better have more than one. You were supposed to have six on your card. Here's six. Go <laughs> ahead. I just asked mine. Oh, okay. So, would you rather, in the bedroom, would you rather dominate or be dominated? That's a good question. Um... <laughs> I say, uh, because you got to pick one. I say, be dominated okay. because I'm always the dominant person. So I want to sit back, you know, like, and see what you're going to do. But you got to know how to dominate, though. You, you okay can't... with a little choky choke? Yeah, that's all right. That's cool. Okay, little choke choke. Okay. Yeah, that's all right. We do a little. <laughs> I mean, okay. you can tell me what to do, you know what I'm saying? Tight shit. Uh-huh, uncle, what you like? Hey, you all about business. <laughs> what about you? Okay, well, we will going to ask you. What about you? Uh, in the bedroom, she was dominating, or like a bitch got down whipping me or something. Is that not necessarily be. just her being in control? Like, nah, if you on top, like she, a female on top, for sure. But outside control. of that, I got the control of shit. Yeah, like, she you can't, the control. So you want to be dominant? You want to be dominant? You want to dominate? Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm trying to, you know what I mean? Okay. Definitely dominate. Okay. <laughs> well, you want me to answer? <laughs> Go ahead. The, the people are dying to know. They're not. No, they um, want to know. They want to hear from you, sir. So. Uh, why me? <laughs> the fuck? Because I'm very vocal. Um, I'm going to let y'all guess what for me. I would definitely, I can tell you the answer for her, too, if y'all want me to. You don't know my life. But I would like to be dominated. Yeah. I don't want to be the dominant. Okay, so what, what would you say that I would choose? You want to be dominant. You think so? I know so. I think so, too. <laughs> I don't. I can't choose because it's whatever. It depends on the mood. I'm talking real. about what. It, 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 yeah, it do depend. I on can't the mood choose. Too, but I'm like, if you if you lean in the percentage. If I had to choose though, contrary to what y'all think, I would rather be dominated. If I had to choose one forever, 
I think <laughs> most females like to be dominated like, a bit. Like, female Taylor slut me out. Yeah, fact. You know yeah. what I mean? But see, that's why I see it. Because it's rare. So if I, yeah. if, I, if I can sit back and let somebody really yeah. go crazy, but I like, could. I go crazy, it's different. You but on, on, t- on Instagram when he was do, doing the jump, he was like, uh, the girl was humping. Cause like, why you gonna go so like? You like, ah, yeah, she stopped in like one minute. She was but bumping. Veronica, <laughs> I, wait, what was this? Wait, wait, what happened? It was a little <laughs> clip on Instagram, he and, and he stroke like, I, how, how we I, be on top? Yeah, in the street, she lasted like twelve seconds. Mm-hmm. Yeah, basically. He oh, he was trying to show he her, like, you can't yeah, even do this. Yeah, we, exactly. you, we be going uh, crazy, and that shit be killing us. Damn, right? Uh, he was trying to show her, and she was like, damn, this is a lot of work. Bitch, and she like, I, it ain't nothing. And he was like, all right, well, go ahead. I'd be fine. Uh, and she okay. Went, and she like, oh, hell. I'd be fine in that regard. I'd be fine yeah. in that regard. I'm very athletic, very high stamina, mag knees on a thousand. Like, and that's why I feel like Ronald could feel like I would be dominant, because I, like, I do be turned up, but. Yep. And I, I've never I had her. Ha- I've never yeah. seen her have sex or nothing. Because <laughs> it kind of sounds like I have. I have we not. Just, we have very like graphic. Let me just talk. You can tell by your energy naturally that you. She's yeah. just dominant. Yeah. She's right. very right. dominant. Why I said she is aggressive. Y'all trying to say that? I no, have she's definitely this. aggressive. Y'all trying to call? Because at first he said, "Yeah, y'all is not more. It's masculine." <laughs> he he won't talk to my man. He's going like this. Now. He's coming, he's going like, me. like, come on. I'm saying I'm doing that because you be like, ready to fuck some up. Absolutely no, right. Like, people be playing on my talk. Okay, um, dark skin or red bone? I love my chocolate one, man. Okay. Ain't that, hey, I mean, you know, don't, don't they, they pretty? You know, you know what I mean? <laughs> they but pretty. <laughs> ain't not like, 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 ain't not like Keisha or Bella Tracy. Yeah, you know okay. I mean? When I got a bar, my son called me Keisha. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He don't even know who he, he don't. He heard his daddy say it, but it's okay. Okay. That's a good one. Yeah, so answer it. <laughs> oh, sh- oh, shit. Both of uh, y'all. Use it I already know. No, I don't know y'all. I don't really know because he like, like a little bit of earth. Like, like, he really don't know. Yeah, have what's no your answer? What you like? <laughs> <laughs> he don't really. I tend to wipe dark skinned girls and mess with light skinned girls. Okay. He, he agree. Come on. Okay, now you, Mr. Romeo. I ain't got no type. But people would know me for light skinned girls. But this girl I got right now is. A straight quiche from belly, dark skin thing that I got that make a light skin girl go crazy. She yeah. really do. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, but people would know me for light skin girls for the most part. But oh, yeah, I got a chocolate girl right now. Something serious. Yeah. I want to strut her around. Facts. <laughs> Facts. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's mine. Get hit or give hit. Oh, that's easy. No, it's not. Cause I, niggas always, some uh, niggas be like, they don't like it. You rather it. get here to get here. Some niggas, this they nigga don't got like that smoking crap. No, he not. I, I, <laughs> I know guys that be like, they I'm, don't even care about him. Yeah. yeah. I didn't had a boyfriend be like, yeah. He's trying to rush in my life. I don't really like, I, I don't know if you yeah, know, really. Not for, nah, we ain't gonna do that. We're not doing that to nobody. This your preference. Yeah, what preference. you preference. would preference. rather do? I don't know. <laughs> I can't believe guys are here. It's no, because I know niggas. Right. I'm telling you, nah, I didn't nah, think. for real though, like, I ain't the please. Like, I ain't okay. the please. Yeah, for real. Yeah, I don't really be tripping. Like, you know what I'm saying? But it's just like, man, some of these girls don't even want you. They make you not even want to do it, man. Yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah, for sure. Man, this Why? Shit, what man. they be doing? They nasty. They, oh, because they, they nasty? Yeah. Who you want to you wanna eat it? Nah, that ain't just so they nasty. Ooh, they, they, they just crazy. They, they don't. Oh, yeah. All right, you, 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 y'all seen the, the, the movie uh, Pretty Woman? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> you see how she conducted herself? Like, once she got with dude, like, just, mm-hmm. you know, like, they don't do the, like, you don't get, that no more, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you for real? Like, somebody you like, oh, shit. Uh, you feel me? Like, mm-hmm. they don't get that for real, but like, I'm Amy Pizzo, so I, I want to give her some head, bro. I, I give it. Nah, 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 I ain't gonna leave. No, it's too late. Don't try to revert that now. Y'all niggas wanna eat pussy money. I want y'all dick suck. I'm gonna say this, though. Because I've been eating pussy money. Y'all niggas wanna eat pussy money. I want y'all dick suck. I'm gonna say this, though. Cause I can't even believe that shit. Like, <laughs> I'd rather get my dick suck than goddamn eat pussy. But I would sometimes rather Eat the pussy to just let her show a girl that, like my skills, cause a nigga fire with this shit for real. You know what I mean? Oh my God. So I would do. He is promoting that. himself with me. Nah, I mean, I, but don't want to come on but, camera. But, but whatever. Also, I also like I'm just kind of also confused in sense, cause like I don't want to eat pussy like that because, like I said, 
you can't do that on a regular with everybody. You know what I mean? So she, I rather, that's where I was yeah. getting that. But we ain't even you. It but can her go, girl can suck my dick though. This, but her you bitch should not be able to suck your dick either. What the fuck? This nigga is crazy. Oh, he's wild in this episode. God damn. Oh, yeah. And we not cutting none of this no, out. We I just thought you didn't know that. Yeah. No, Do no, not no, cut none of this out. It's a hundred shots. A bitch can get a hundred shots. <laughs> she can get a hundred shots. A hundred of them bitches. Oh, oh man. Let me shut that up. Come on, dig it up. Dig it up. I don't want to ask. It's too raunchy. Okay, so. If it's my man, I'm gonna like to give. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, that's my answer. That's a good answer. Okay. Your turn, next question. <laughs> no, your turn. <laughs> answer the question. I'd rather give head, just yeah. cause. I mean, that's just I like giving <sighs> head. Like I like to give niggas. I like head. to see the reaction. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, you know what I'm saying? Cause I be, bitch, I be weak. Mm -hmm. Okay, in my head I be so mm -hmm. weak. Like, yeah, nigga, got your ass. <laughs> yeah, what you said? Yeah, bitch. Oh, so yeah. Shit. But see, the shit so crazy though. Cause back in the day, like when I was in high school and younger, you know what I mean? Cause I'm like 39. So when I'm like in 2000, 2001, two, all head won't need like give females ain't love giving head. I'm like be clear. Lil Wayne, 2010, I cried the first time, time I shot dick. Duh, you know, be clear. I definitely won't with that shit at first. Why I cried. Wrong? Yeah, it was just horrible. Like I just felt so vile and disgusting. Like, oh my God, I can't. I literally said, I can't believe I just did that and bust out crying. A nigga dick still out and everything. I'm just, you know what I'm saying? I was so disgusted with myself. And what, did he, what did he say? He was tripping. He didn't say nothing. He just he's, she scared the shit out, out of him. I mean, he got it. He of course he put his clothes and shit back on, but he didn't say nothing. He ain't go nowhere. He still was my boyfriend. Like okay, okay. He loved me. We loved each other. No, I didn't cry the first time. I, did. I definitely did. But um, and plus, like niggas be talking all that. They got this bomb. That shit don't be good. Y'all had be garbage as fuck, and sometimes it hurts. I'm good. You can't see y'all. Yeah, you gonna say y'all. You said, uh, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> we not gonna do that. You ain't gonna, nah. But I won't talk about y'all yeah. too, right? And we she ain't talking about, about you. you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I, would, I, 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 I like that. I like that. I don't know. We not talking about y'all either. I don't know. Like, I, don't know. Yeah. I don't know what none of y'all. She said y'all because of the I people that's watching. I don't know what anybody watching. in this room yeah. is capable yeah. of doing. Okay, and I done okay. had some fires here too. Be clear, like. Mm. Some men yeah. don't know what they're doing. But a lot of men don't know what they're doing. I'm not gonna say a lot because I've not experienced a lot of them, but I have experienced a few. Put your tongue and on I the will click, tell fellas. you to stop. Put your tongue oh, on the click. Do, Take your time, fellas. <laughs> exactly. Be Please. gentle. I'm yeah. Gentle. That is a very sensitive She's area. She's not squirming because you're going off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's, She's trying to move. <laughs> <laughs> but look, see, and I'm so let you say that. Let me say the same thing for a female though. Go ahead. That jank got down, got down, doing a uh, tea bag type thing. You know what I mean? Sucking that nigga nuts, and she going ham, hey, going too hard. You know that shit sensitive right there. Yeah. So it's like a nigga punch me in my nuts while she sucking. <laughs> you know what I mean? So she I was sucking real, real hard. So ladies, Man, hell yeah. when you're dealing with testicles, hey, you got to be just like with the clip. Be, be gentle, agree. ladies. Be gentle. Be gentle. You got any more? Um, missionary or back shots? I like missionary. Mr. Man? Oh, I'm a, I'm back shot God. That's my thing. No, I'm not fucking choosing. I like missionary, like so I can see him nibble on your ear and whisper and moan your more ear and shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it's more. Interesting. He's okay. a lover. He uh, made that very clear. He's a lover, yeah, a so lover. he wanna make love, love to yeah. a bitch. Yeah. You hear what Gates said that shit? I don't do that microwave pussy. That yeah, yeah, yeah. Feel me. <laughs> that I mean. bean. Yeah, I gotta take my time. With you feel me? Okay, um, Khadija. See, it's so situational for me. Okay, we're not. We're, I cannot. I'm a Virgo. I can't. You can. I can't. What do you Which prefer? Or bachelor? Let me see. Which one feels better? I'm thinking. It's just so hard to choose. I'm gonna just go with bat shots, though. I'm gonna go bat shots, little thumb. You know. Little thumb. Little thumb. Yeah, we go crazy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but we good. We're great, actually. Okay. Yeah, answer. Oh, yeah. She trying to swim. I'm about to say that. Um, bat shots for me for sure. 
I, don't I only want to be missionary with somebody like that. I love that you fuck yeah. with. Like, I yeah. don't want no nigga kissing like. Yeah, she don't have. I, don't I mean, I don't have niggas. sex, but I don't need having sex I'm with celibate, niggas. I'm celibate, as I've told y'all yeah. before. I am celibate. Yeah. So, so, so we have sex. But we I not gonna act like we've never had sex with somebody that we didn't give a fuck about, and in those situations, I don't want you breathing all in my face, kissing on me, care your motherfucking ass. Or it could have been somebody that I used to care about, but and you I just don't don't want to really fuck with them now. But come through right quick. And you preaching that, that you do, and it's slap. But don't kiss me. Yeah, but I don't want you we, to feel like you only got to take your shoes off, my boy. <laughs> <laughs> That's fast. In and out. You need to have me up, like. And okay. You know, that, that, that's that's the masculine side of ladies these days. <laughs> y'all talking like a nigga, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we over here talking more like you like the nigga. Like, y'all want to love you, on the men. That the mm-hmm. men have made the women this way. Like if yeah, y'all, I'm trying like to. I'm, but but all manliness aside, like in a relationship with somebody I love, I'm so submissive. You can ask Monica. Like I'm so submissive. I'm such a, you know what I'm saying. I brought back and shit. I wake up six in the morning and make breakfast before I go to work and shit. Like, I'm that. But it takes, like, a certain type of nigga to bring that out of me. And it was brought out of me, but, you know. So let's say, so basically, if if it's not a relationship, y'all ain't trying to get too much on the intimate type tip. I mean, why are we Let's say if that nigga dicking you down. Because I know when you dicking somebody down, they don't go, fuck, they start losing it. And they won't kiss me. But guess what? If he's dicking you down like that. We're in a relationship. <laughs> we go together. Like, but you have to go nowhere else. Like, you're not fucking nobody else. I don't like we, kiss. We're together. That's not my thing anyway. Like, I don't like kissing. So I got to really like you. Yeah, I got to love you. Yeah, I forgot. She ain't in a fashion. No, because kissing is... Pers- you see that crazy. on the camera? Like, my shit, your shit, my dick. Like, that's crazy. Y'all don't like kissing? Mm-mm. I gotta love you. Saliva is nasty. I mean, when we at that point, point it's somebody you love. But y'all, but know, I will kiss I don't somebody like, that I'm in love with. I will do that. But I, I, I wake up kissing me, but I'm cheating. I'm but this is the thing. Alone. I had a my man, first kiss was real bad. Morning, it was traumatic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he is. My first kiss was so traumatic. <laughs> Your first everything was traumatic. Yes, my first kiss was so <laughs> traumatic. I just didn't want. I didn't want to ever kiss again after that. And I tried to avoid. My first kiss was not traumatic. It was. It was horrible. Like I. I'm even gonna say the nigga name because he probably watched it. And you know you was a horrible fucking kid. <laughs> you know all that slot was not necessary. You didn't want me like that, nigga. We was oh, in middle school and the nigga keep telling me to come out the class. You know how you taste each other. But I knew he wanted to kiss or something, so I kept lying. I heard that was like, nigga wouldn't let me come out the classroom and shit. Like he won't let me go to the bathroom. So one day I actually went and we like met under the steps and I gave him the kiss. It was horrible. He never got a kiss after that. He ended up cheating on me too. We was just in middle school. He didn't fangin' the bitch in the movie. That shit tell me. That shit crazy. <laughs> you ain't even wanna kiss me. Oh man, well, you definitely won't stick your fingers in me. What oh, the fuck? Shit. <laughs> People used to be wildin'. I don't know what the fuck I they miss, I miss school. Yeah, me too. Me too. I if I can go back to school, I would. I'll do that. Now, that's what I'll do. Yeah. Definitely. If that was a question. I don't understand why kids don't like school nowadays. I love school. School, school was But lit. school is different. School's getting <laughs> shot up. Other kids bringing guns to school like this yeah, generation is just different. Their generation is definitely school different. School is becoming house. dangerous. We mm-hmm. have funded school. You can't and if we skip school now. And then, honestly, Man, right. if, we fought, we, of school. if we fought, we fought, won't nobody come in, you know what I'm saying? Nobody yeah. getting shot up the mob because mm-hmm. I beat your ass like I just beat your ass and that's it. I skipped school one day for Valentine's Day. Oh, what you was doing? Humping. Ooh. All day long. <laughs> hey, I don't think I ever humped so much in my life. <laughs> Still. <laughs> Like <laughs> that shit was crazy. Well, was, huh? Can we bring up something else? It was I was and by the way, I was in the eleventh grade. And I had just started humping, but baby, yeah. when I started, they ain't stopped. Mm. <laughs> that was a tag. <laughs> no bullshit. My first girl thing was like. When you get that first will, when you chase me, well, no good. I won't have sex for a long time and then my mama somebody told my mom that I was having sex and I really wasn't. So once she thought I was, mine she as well. Fuck it, mine as well. So that was the first time around that age. Yeah. My first time, I was 17. I got a question. So how old was y'all when y'all lost y'all virginity? I was 17. 16. Me too. I was 17. I was 16. I was late. How old I was you? in 11th grade, though. Hmm. How old were you? Like 14. That's typical age for yeah, a boy. For a boy. I, like, I felt like I felt yeah, I, like I felt like I lost my virginity too soon, but then I'm not throwing y'all bitches under the bus, but y'all was popping. No, them bitches. In comparison to my friends, them bitches like when I was living in Norfolk, I had bitches in the sixth grade that was sucking dick. Yeah, like, yeah. 
Yeah, I it. wouldn't have fucking dared. Nah, niggas got here in middle school. You know what sure. I'm saying? Nah, so, no in comparison yeah, to the top. people around me, I was a late boomer, but still, in retrospect, I feel like 16 was a bit. You soon. almost couldn't get a kiss out of me in middle but, school. But, oh, wow. Yeah, I, Man, I didn't really like. Yeah, really I didn't like lose my virginity and just keep fucking, 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 fucking. Like I lost my virginity. I had a boyfriend. And then I took a minute. I, have school, I did all too. of my high school years. I dated the same guy, and he is one of my baby daddies. Facts. Oh, yeah. So I only had sex with him. Mm-hmm. Yeah, my first was tried to be time. abusive. To and be he cheated ass. on me my ninth and tenth grade. Because <laughs> <laughs> I won't fuck it. Oh, okay. So since you he had was. All right, this is the last one for real, for real, for real. Okay, so would you rather be the plus one in a threesome or bring a plus one into your threesome? <clears throat> All right, be the plus one. So oh, it's, bring one. And it don't have to be, you don't have to be the plus one with a man and a woman. It could be like two bitches and then they want to bring you in their bedroom. Or you could be you and your lady, y'all bring a bitch in the bedroom. First of all, What's are you with threesomes? What are you like? Are you, no, are you okay? Right. Oh, okay. All right. Because some men aren't. Yeah, I do know men that be like, hell no, I'm not Man, doing that. you tripping. I'm telling you now, you tripping. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you talking about. Absolutely. Yeah, okay, so which one? Um, it really wouldn't even matter, but... <laughs> <laughs> You no, know, I just say because but, but, it might nah. be fun. It might be a fun thing to do with somebody that you like your significant yeah, other. That you feel what I'm saying? But I, I never really done it with like two total strangers. Like oh, okay. Female, yeah, yeah, yeah. My man, so I don't know. That, that might that be, be something fun, spontaneous. Yeah. yeah, yeah, But um, yeah. I guess I will bring them in there with me and we dominate her type shit. Me and my girl, mm. you feel me? We tear her ass up. <laughs> <laughs> You miss the And it's on you. Uh, uh, off top, it's always two girls. Because I feel like if it's me and another nigga hitting a girl, that's a train. It's not a train. That's a train. That's a threesome. It's a train. If it's you and two other niggas, it's a train. It's a train. No, it, 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 that's a threesome. So is you, her, a threesome her. is three people. Mm-hmm. It didn't say, no there's no way. definition that says three no has way. to be. No, a three way is a three way, my nigga. No, it's not. Uh, is that all three? Uh, Let's just agree really. to disagree. Yeah, because that's ridiculous. Okay, so I would rather get down. I would rather bring, be with a girl, and we bring a girl in. Okay. Or if two girls hit me up and they write shit, you so know what just, I mean? They, they both answer the question yeah, the same way. Yeah. We did. Uh, Y'all didn't answer it, but whatever. It's all good. So I, I say I bring. I, no, I you say you would. I bring with me. So I, I had it both be. ways, and it really don't matter. My boy said so he had it both ways. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, I guess it wouldn't matter as much to the men as it matters to the women. I guess. Yeah, because it's y'all comfortability yeah. at the end of the day. Yeah. We yeah. just plug in, plug and play. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't too complicated, Monica. What are you? How do you feel? I plead the fifth. Okay. Well, if she's pleading. <laughs> I'm sticking beside her. <laughs> And I'm gonna plead as well. I'm gonna get my lawyer on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I already said it. I would rather be bored in. Okay. Like a monogamous couple, like a clean monogamous couple yeah. bring me in and just have your way with me. So yeah. you wouldn't rather you, you, no. you do no. bring a Jane in? No, I don't even really want to have a I got, with my nigga. I don't I want no bitch sucking on my yeah. nigga dick, doing yeah, all this. Good. She been to get him gone, he hit her on the side. Like, no, because yeah. I ain't going to hit your nigga on the side. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? I'm never, I'm not going to fuck your nigga on the side. I'm going to keep it G like. Y'all call me when y'all want to have a good time. But and I'm not, you know what I saying? heard most girls be like that too. Like, hey, yeah, trust bitches yeah, though. More so they'll say like, if I love a nigga, I don't want him I to be really threesome. Wanna... But if I don't really fuck with a nigga like that, and we, we can do it. But if I love a nigga, I don't want to share the nigga. But even if I fuck, if, I don't know. Just I don't want no nigga of mine so no love, mm-hmm. bitch. We good. <laughs> it don't matter. Would y'all let it, like the Fifty Shades of Grey? Would y'all let somebody like, dominate y'all like that? Yeah, I got like <laughs> I have stuff that can like tie me up and restrict me and shit. Yeah, like let's try. I'm with. I like trying shit. Got little wigs and stuff. Like let's be creative. Like, you know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like I like. I think sex should be fun. Like I like to nah, laugh right, when I'm right, having right. sex and shit. Like I. But like, you see, at first, like he was kind of fucking her up a little bit. Like now, nah, don't fuck me up because I might have to fuck you up like, too. Like he was whooping her. And she, was, you know, she ain't know. But do some people her. are like pain, like pain. Yeah, pain, the pain. Like pain would you got somebody put you through that type of it pain? On, it depends on. It depends <laughs> on. It depends on. <laughs> I, I don't know because I've never been in that situation. It depends on. It depends I've on. never been in. Uh, Cause you know you like. It depends on not too much, but a little. I have a high tolerance for pain. I can say that. 
Yeah. Um, but I'm spontaneous, so I, I think I would. In my mouth, I would. No, don't put shit in no, my mouth. Hell no. I don't want that in my mouth. No. No. Mouth. Mouth. But yeah. outside of that, we, uh, like, we can try. Give me a safe but word, safe and we word. might be on. And I keep yeah. my safe word. Do not play with me because if you play with me, do not fucking go to sleep. Don't think shit. Don't be funny. <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> do not go to sleep. Yeah, Tom. If we doing Christian, the name of the movie? Fifty Shades, Shades of Grey. Oh, no, nah, I ain't never seen that. Oh, shit. you need to get with Christian Grey. No what shit. the hell is wrong nah, with you? I'm a traditional ass nigga. I ain't really with no whips and chains and bars and shit. <laughs> nah, bro, 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 Nah. It's like that. It's, it's like, like that, that too. Just like that. Watch, yeah. watch it, it tonight. Check nah, it out. I'm, I'm, I'm a whole nigga. Huh? You and what? you and your <laughs> You and Keisha. Y'all can watch that together. And yeah, it could get spicy. Nah, it's already spicy. It could get spicy. Yeah. Be spontaneous. Goddamn you. Listen, if I told you what happened last night, you would be like, you. Oh, he do tell. No way. Do tell. Do tell. It's my interview. Okay. Um. So we gonna wrap this up. I don't mean to rush y'all out, but you know, it's Friday night. So, um, tell them, you know, what upcoming projects and shows you got. Like, you got anything up and coming that the people uh, can come and check out? I Any got, videos about to drop? I got, uh, well, <clears throat> we're just working on a video today. Me and my bros, uh, Quano Bands and Fat Boy Reek. We just shot a video before I came here. That's why I was late. I apologize. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, y'all, he was late. Mm -hmm. they, they got me too, they got me. I seen it in their eyes and I come in the door, I said, oh man, I ain't even want to look at them no more. <laughs> but yeah, I got that, then I, I opened up for Jadakiss on the 15th at London Lounge. Mm -hmm. I love him, um, that's her favorite rapper. I got a documentary Tell coming Jada out. Tell Jada watch Moon Child. Moon Child. Oh yeah, you. yeah, yeah, I'm gonna tag him in this jump. Um, <clears throat> I got a documentary coming out, that jump will be super butter, like, they gonna really love that jump. Uh, I, I thought like, you already had a documentary. I ain't, I ain't finished it yet. Oh, okay, okay. I, ain't finished. Okay. I got like four, five more scenes, mm -hmm. and then I'm done with it. So yeah, that's that's about it for real, for real. I'm working on a lot of music. I got that 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 Jada jump, um, like four, five videos coming out. I got like four, five videos this whole month. So my birthday the 17th, I'm going crazy. April 17th, I'm going crazy all month. Okay. I'm dropping and working all month. You know what I mean? Okay, and so where can the people Find your stuff. How uh, can they you find, find you? Find me on Instagram, D I N A H D O Y A, Dina Do You. I ain't never get to break that down, too. Okay. Oh, yeah. Like, Tell us why that's your name. All right, so, so Dina Do You. I know a lot of people think it's violence or whatever, but it's like I'm going to outdo you in anything, any form of fashion. I'm going to outdo me, you know what I mean? The old me or whatever the case may be. But you have to think highly of yourself in any aspect of life. So when I say I'm going to do you, I'm going to outdo you, I'm going to outwork you, I'm going to outthink you. I'm, anything of outdoing you, I'm going to do it. You know what I mean? I'm going to make it my business to do it. You know what I'm saying? Then that's that. I mean, but yeah, you follow me on IG. And he, he, IG gonna take you real well. Y'all just come to Instagram. <laughs> yeah, come well, to Instagram. It's, it's, it's gonna you. take you to his YouTube yeah, yeah, where yeah. you can like, comment, and subscribe. Y'all yeah. already know what to do after y'all watch this. If you haven't already, you're gonna like, comment, and subscribe. Ashi, um, our next episode, we do have another guest. Um, I don't wanna give y'all too much. And it's just so crazy. She's another female. She's also had like some legal woes and shit. And you know, I'm finna get in her business. So, um, tune yeah. in, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and uh, we do appreciate y'all. Thanks for all the feedback. Keep it coming. Um, you know, our um, inbox is always open to suggestions. So follow us. We will put our Instagram down here. And we will catch y'all back with episode five. Four, five, five, five. Peace. Ooh, child. Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about it. it.